Hi everyone, welcome to my class, the Olustar class, where we teach mathematics and statistics. In today's class, we want to look at how to find this exponential equation. We want to find the real value of x from this exponential equation. 3 raised to power x plus 9 raised to power s is equal to 27 raised to power x. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And also turn on the notification bell to all so that you can be notified whenever we post new video. Solution. Then we have 3 raised to power x plus 9 raised to power s to be equal to 27 raised to power x. This can be rewrite as 3 raised to power x plus 3 raised to power 2x to be equal to 27 is 3 raised to power 3x. That is 3 times 3 times 3. That is 27. So, this can be rewrite as we have 3 raised to power x plus 3 raised to power 2x minus 3 raised to power 3s to be equal to what? 0. Sorry, this is 3. Then, this can also be rewrite as because this one has a power of 3 and this is power of 2x. So, let's rearrange. We have 3 raised to power 3x minus 3 raised to power 2x minus 3 raised to power s to be equal to what? 0. Then you've just transformed the negative into positive. So this, if you multiply through by the negative, you have minus times this minus will become plus. That is 3 raised to power 3x minus times plus this 3 raised to power 2s will be minus 3 raised to power 2s. The minus times plus uh, 3 raised to power s will be minus 3 raised to power s is equal to 0. That's why how we get that value. Then the next thing is let y to be equal to 3 raised to power x. y is equal to 3 raised to power s. This implies that we have then y raised to power 3 minus y square minus y will be equal to what? 0. So we say y is equal to 3 raised to power x. This can be right that let's factor this. We have y into y square minus y minus 1 is equal to what? 0. This implies that y is equal to 0 or y square minus y minus 1 is equal to 0. Then we've considered this. This is y is equal to 0. Let's consider this case. We have y square minus y minus 1 will be equal to 0. So by using quadratic general formula, we have y will be equal to what? Minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then from this equation, we have our a to be equal to 1, b is equal to minus 1, and c is equal to minus 1. a is equal to 1, the coefficient of y square here, b is coefficient of y here is minus 1, and c is equal to what? Constant, minus 1. Then we substitute, we have y is equal to, our minus b is what? We have minus into minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square minus 4 times 1 times minus 1 over 2 times 1. 
that is our a so you can see this is minus times minus will become plus then y will be equal to what one plus or minus here we have minus one square that will be one square root of one then this is four minus four times one times minus one to become plus four plus four over two which is equal to one plus square root of what five over two therefore we have y is equal to what one sorry here is plus or minus one plus root five over two or y is equal to one minus root five over two therefore the corresponding value of y huh? y is equal to what zero one plus root five over two one minus root five over two but we know that but we said t raised to power s is equal to y this implies that we have t raised to power s is equal to zero t raised to power s is equal to what one plus root 5 over 2 then t raised to power s is equal to 1 minus root 5 over 2 from here we have t raised to power s is equal to 0 here then since exponential equation is always greater than 0 no value of s can make this equation true so we conclude that here no solution solution then if you consider this again let's look at this one here is negative one minus root five so here too is not valid but the only read value here is what t raised to the power a is equal to 1 plus root of 5 over 2. So let's consider this as a raised value. We are left with t raised to the power a is equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then by the law of logarithm, we have log t raised to the power s is equal to what? Log one plus root five over two then this implies that we have x log three here with base three we got what log of what one plus root five over two this one we cancel this we have s will be equal to what log with base three one plus root five root five over two that is our read value solution please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe this is root five root five don't forget to like share comment and subscribe thank you don't forget to like the video comment on the video share the video and subscribe please subscribe thank you